all right guys welcome welcome to another tutorial this is your host classic games united and today we're gonna be doing tutorials for fall of um transformers fall of cybertron uh transformers revenge of the fallen transformers rise of the dark spark and we'll be doing a tutorial on um um black light black light tango um no black light redistribution right so this um intro will cover for all these games that i'll be doing a tutorial on right because i know it's not easy to install these games and get them working online the tutorial is mostly for multiplayer so you'll be able to play with your friends and stuff and sometimes it will be a bit confusing all right so um i'm gonna show you a lot of get these um games working today so stay tuned guys and i'll see you all back in the video all right all right all right guys welcome to the tutorial and today we'll be gonna be doing follow up cybertron first right so this is the game here guys and these are the um files that will be needed for the game right all right so i'm gonna do a tutorial now on how to get this game to work on multiplayer all right so if you want to play the game on multiplayer i'll show you how to do that now right now i cannot list the link where i get the game from you know this game is delisted from from steam it's no longer being sold but just join the discord server and i'll give you all a copy of the game right so you just um extract it here extract the files um here all right so right now the files is extracting all right and then i had to get us some time to extract right so once the once it's reached 100 percent it will make a noise indicating that it's finished right so i'll be back once all this is finished um extracting right all right guys the game is done uh finished downloading as you see okay, it is extracted and this is the folder here so go on this go to steam apps go to commander this is steam rip so that is why it opening all these folders right but you want to put these in the steam the actual steam um folder right so if you're like me and have a lot of um folders on your desktop open up one of the folders go to here well for you for you it will be named this pc but i rename mine to so classic games united click on that go to your local this c open up um program file 86 go to steam go to steam apps go to common right and go back to the folder here and drag um the game into here all right so it will be like this all right and right now you want to copy the crack files because if you, if you open the game it will open up in steam because this is that steam rip right so go back to here go back to here all right go to downloads open up here and go to these are the crack files here right So you open up that you will just click on it like this you will need winra to extract the files so you will have to download Win winra i will put the um, link in the description for winra open up here right back to here right open up binaries um folder and you will copy copy the crack files and you will put them here all right so that will be it for the for the game and you will be able to start at the game but we're not done yet we want to get the game to be working online so i will start the game and i'll show you all that the online is not working then I'll show you all how to get the game online working, alright? So I'll be back. Alright guys, I forget to show you all to, to, to create a shortcut. Go to the binary folder. Um right click. Create shortcut, right? And what you will do is that you will drag this shortcut. Or you could you could click here. 
So click here right and it should, it should be able to see center shortcut. Center desktop shortcut. Alright. Alright, so the, 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 um, the shortcut is right there. Okay. And you could delete that. So now when you go to here now, open file, you'll be able to see the shortcut here and you could just rename it. Transformers Fall of Cyber Tron. Alright? So now we're gonna get into the game and I'll show you that the multiplayer is not Alright guys, we're back in the game. As you can see, uh, multiplayer does not work. Alright? That is because we did not um, apply the fix right. So, you wouldn't get to play multiplayer, right? So now I'm going to show you how to get multiplayer and how to get everything working. Because if you all watched my tutorial on, on War for Cybertron, that one was very easy. But this one here... A uh, lot of people have problems with this one, so I'm gonna show you how to fix that, right? So let's get back to um, we go to Discord now to get the fix. So we'll be able to play online, okay? All right, so let's um, let's go. All right, guys, to get the game working online, we we'll go to um, we we'll go to um, we have to join the warehouse Discord server, the warehouse. When you joined, you will have to verify double count double counter will send you a message the double counter bot will send you a message uh i wonder if i have that but i may, I may be deleted the bot messages but the bot will send you a messages click on verify and you'll be able to join the server right so you will need to type this code because this is um transformers um fall of cybertron type this And you will get a mess. Uh, um, you will get a message here, right? So to finish setup for Cybertron, um, follow Cybertron PC to online play. Follow the guide. So we know we have to go to the guide. So open up the guide and visit. Alright, guys, these steps are very simple. Just follow me. Follow everything I do. Take your time watch the tutorial over and over and over and just follow my steps right this is very this is very simple tutorial guys not very hard right so once you follow me everything should be working and you wouldn't have no problems i guarantee you 100 percent 1 million percent you wouldn't have no problems if you follow my tutorials right okay so remember to click on here and to open the website for you with the guide right so read let's read through to get your new key which makes it possible to connect to warehouse servers you need to join our discord server and message our bot we don't already join the discord already we don't already message the bot so complete verification just read here you have to complete the verification as i said and this is the code that you type in this the, the um channel right so you will start from here check your dm for your shiny new key press the download button here to save the file to your desktop right so this is your key here download your key continue to download all right the key is downloaded that is it the right steam account linking all right now we will need to link the account right so you will just go to here all right sign in with steam i made a new account here which is this sign in with steam right all right your steam id oh this is my steam id here right please enter your key below all right so the key that you will need to enter is this this is the key here guys right so enter the key just uh, copy And then control and V to paste. Verify that you're not a human. Um, uh, this that. link account. Account was linked. 
All right, our account was linked. Click OK. The account is now um, linked, right? Now go back to here. Go back to here. Go back to here. Press sign in. All right, all right, all right. Link your account. Account was all done. The Steam ID you will see on the screen should be set up as your Steam ID or you want me to log in, right? So it must be set up on Steam. This is your Steam ID. Alright, so um Alright. This is for um non-steam users. Apply new key. This part is different for Steam and non-steam users. Our Windows 11 users may have to do some extra steps. Steam version. Navigate to your copy of Steam. Alright, click properties. You under go to alright. You type your, your CD key, but I don't have the game on Steam, guys. It's a Steam rip, and we don't really need to do this step. Alright, let's skip to here. Close option. Alright, double click on the file to download the right. This is the key. They said double click on that. Click run. Click OK, right? Alright, that's it there. All done. Okay, this is for Windows 11 users. You will just read through this if you have Windows 11. Read through that, right? Now we will have to um, replace the game Colors Ed, right? So, um, you will have to download the Colors Ed ED. So, download the Colors Ed. Click on that. Download file. So, make sure to do this, guys. Um, okay. Go to follow Cybertron, open file location, right? Back to the game. Color set, right? And you have to replace the color set file, alright? Go to downloads, alright? And drag and drop, replace the file, right? Replace the file, alright? Launch multiplayer and play. All right, guys, we did all these steps. Sometimes we'll have problems. Let's see if it works right. So, um, I will go and start at the game and I will see if it, will, if it will work right. If it does not work, we'll do some troubleshooting, right? So, let's go back, go back into the game and see if multiplayer is gonna work. Let's see if we follow these steps correctly, right? So, I'll be back in the game, guys. All right, guys, you're back in the game now. When you go to here, you'll get this error. Cannot create account maximum number of uh, um of accounts allowed, right? We'll get the same thing here. The worry will fix this, right? So let's get to fixing this now, right? I'll be back. Let's fix this problem. Alright, guys, we have a fix here which is this. Alright. So what you will do guys is go to open the game, right? We're gonna fix the maximum number of accounts allowed. Uh, and you will just need just to delete this right delete all this and copy these new files right copy these new files and i believe that should fix the problem right so uh, let's see if it fixed the problem guys let's open up the game and let's see if that fixed the problem right i'll be back all right guys one uh, the control is not working with that fix but we'll fix that so uh, as you see as you click on multiplayer it now works and voila this is my old um steam name battlefield but one thing the controller is not working but um we'll fix the controller problem so i'll show you how to fix the controller problem right so as you see guys it works you could go into multiplayer now and you could um you could you could um play the game right so if your controller is not working guys even though you set the controller options to control is not working i will show you guys how to fix the controller right so let's fix the controller now i'll be back all right guys we're gonna fix the controller um issue now and this guy is by sana so all thanks to him because i was trying to find a way to fix the controller but i wasn't getting it right so first he says start the game all right shift tab start the game press the controller icon press the arrow select export 360 default press apply layout all right so let's try that now guys 
so uh, i'll see you all back in the game right and let's see if we could fix that controller issue from the uh, we are back in the game guys and as you can see my controller is not working but if i move the arrow keys on the keyboard it will work but when i use my controller it's not working right so what you'll do you'll press shift and tab no press shift and tab guys go to the controller icon right press the arrow which is here and go to community layouts and click on export 360 default and press apply press apply right all right so and then press back um shift tab and there you go guys your controller is working right so we can now use our controller you could go to multiplayer now you could go to multiplayer now guys this was a very hard tutorial to do and i will show you how to change your name right you see how my name is battlefield 346 here if you want to change your name now i will show you how to do that right but um let's create a match first and i'll show you how to change your name after okay so go to, to create a character if you want up to you go to private match um create go to that match right create a game um select a map wherever and then start the game and let's see how it's working guys let's see if it have any issues used here sometimes you may have issues like graphical issues you understand so this is why i'm doing this right now so we have to wait a bit till the game starts it's going to start just now and i hope that i don't have any graphical issues with this guys because that would be a problem all right guys the game is working fine the graphics is good it's right but as you see guys it's working so it's working guys it's working it's working no issues don't mind the lagging don't mind the lag guys done recording right but it is working no issues here right so bye right, guys we are back and you want to change your name right so we profile because this is my name in the game right set up profile let's just say set up profile now okay all right so you could change your name right change your name and of course my name is classic games united all right i'll just put my new name whatever but i'll put the actual rename and you just save that all right guys and that's all you have to do so once you go back in the game now you will see that your name has been changed right so let's get back into the game guys and that will be for you tutorial right i'll show you that my name has changed we'll create a match we'll play a little bit and then that will be the end of the tutorial right so let's get back into the game okay guys you're back into the game with some multiplayer and as you see name has been changed to classic games united so that's it so we could create a match again if you want we could private match that match map voting whose choice 20 minutes create game right all right okay guys we'll see the camera up right see the camera that you want to play on um let's try right, we'll try this map right start the game
Evaluate again. So you see guys, name has been changed to Classic Games United. Very simple, very easy. I know that this tutorial may, may take a bit long, but guys, it, it's worth it. It's worth it. Everything is looking very good now. Looking good, guys. You can see my name there. And if you want to join that game, just find silver. So it's that simple, guys. Not that hard. Alright guys, thanks for watching and I hope that this tutorial was um, simple and easy and I will see you, in a, uh, I will see you all in um, Transformers um, Rise of the Dark Spark tutorial, right? I, I will try to do that tutorial today as well so I will see you all back in that tutorial, right? So thanks for watching guys and I hope that you all enjoyed this I hope I wasn't confused and I hope that you all understand me and understand my English so without that, without saying that, without that being said, guys, thanks for watching again, and take care and bye. Roll out! Roll out!